It is now widely accepted that greenhouse gas emissions, mainly carbon dioxide, are the primary contributors to climate change. CO2 emissions from the power sector already account for 40% of the energy sector's CO2 emissions, and the demand for power generation capacity is projected to almost double by 2030. Hence, the need to generate a significant amount of clean electricity has never been more urgent. Abu Dhabi is planning to play a leading role in developing large-scale, low-carbon energy solutions for power generation and answer the world need for power whilst reducing CO2 emissions. By combining existing proven technologies, it is now possible to develop an economically viable project in Abu Dhabi which simultaneously liberates much-needed gas from oil fields, enhances oil recovery and delivers clean power to fuel the country's continued growth. With the support of the government of Abu Dhabi and its progressive approach to alternative energy, Abu Dhabi Future Energy Company, Mazdar and Hydrogen Energy are proposing to build the world's first hydrogen-fueled power plant. Given the project's gas and oil benefits, the project is of significant value and the cost of electricity will be equivalent to that of a conventional power plant. Natural gas will be piped to the plant through a pipeline and will then be cleaned to remove substances such as sulphur. It will enter a reformer, where it will be combusted with steam at high pressures to form synthesis gas. This syngas will then go through a shift reaction and continue on to be split in carbon dioxide removal towers into its component gases, hydrogen and carbon dioxide. The captured carbon dioxide will be compressed, dehydrated transported via a pipeline and injected into an oil field. The CO2 will replace natural gas, which is currently being injected into the oil field to maintain pressure. The natural gas can then be used instead for domestic use or export. Deployed at scale, this technology would release lots of additional natural gas for Abu Dhabi, while meeting the growing power demand of the Emirates. As the carbon dioxide enters the oil field, it could enable 100 million barrels of additional oil to be recovered. This enhanced oil recovery technique could increase Abu Dhabi's recoverable oil reserves by about 2 billion barrels. Abu Dhabi is already exploring the potential of this technology for a number of different oil fields. As the oil is forced out, the carbon dioxide remains stored securely and permanently beneath a natural impervious seal. With some 90% of the carbon dioxide captured and stored, the hydrogen is burned to generate around 420 megawatts of clean electricity, with water vapor being the main emission. This project alone would provide more than 5% of all the current Abu Dhabi power generation and will capture and store up to 1.7 million tons of carbon dioxide each year, the equivalent of taking all the cars in Abu Dhabi off the road. All the individual elements of the technology required are operating successfully across the world. The project partners will bring the necessary capabilities to integrate the technologies and deliver a world-leading position for Abu Dhabi.